Today, we are reacting to some shocking bearded dragon TikToks. Why do we keep doing this, man? We keep doing these reacting TikTok videos. Bro, everyone yeah. loved them last time. Right, first one. Now, can we stop making this a trend? I'm seeing this all the time now. Bearded dragons swimming in a pool. It's a, I mean, it seems to be good enrichment, doesn't it? I mean, I, I don't rate it. It's too much hassle, too much stress, too much... Could, too much could go wrong. Why'd you do it? Why? Do we just sit here forever? Well, kinda, unless Bebo shows up. What the hell's Bebo? Guys, look! Bebo! <laughs> no! <laughs> Bye, Jim! Bye, Jim! <laughs> Next one! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, that's life, isn't it? You want some food, you want a chocolate bar, you want a kebab, you want a pizza. No, you've got to eat salad, especially me. I just have to look at cake and oh my god, I put two stone on instantly. Next one, next one. I said, do you want to fight? <laughs> do you want to catch his hand? <laughs> Bitch, I'll catch you in the street. Some with that beef. Bitch, I'll beat your Bearded dragon with attitude. <laughs> just jumps on him at the end and boof. <laughs> Bearded dragon squaring up to a cat. I'm not a big lover of people mixing pets, like especially cats. Cats can be vicious little gits. One second they can be all cute and cuddly, giving you the cute eyes. Next second they're ripping your face to pieces. They can give me some food. And they only want food. They're, they're willing to kill you for food. <laughs> right, next. Again, swimming in the sea. Why do we do this? Do uh, Actually, is there anybody watching from Australia where they've actually got bearded dragons in the wild. Do they do this? Let me know in the comments down below. Or if you know somebody who knows somebody whose aunts and uncles are in Australia. Let me know in the comments down below. Next! So my bearded dragon titan had eggs. We thought titan Hi. was a boy. <laughs> but no, he is a she. He is a she. Ooh, eggs! <laughs> yeah, how often does that happen? I actually, little behind the scenes of Northern Exotics, we actually set up a video where we were going to troll the Bearded Dragon Facebook groups. Now, they've, they're well known for being the most toxic place for reptile keepers on the internet. So we thought, right, we're going to troll them. We're going to get onto them. So we, we got approved and stuff like that. We had to fill in loads of questions. Then they just put a picture of Bearded Dragon, uh, my... Bearded Dragon's enclosure up onto their pages. Just thought, there's so many things wrong with that, they're gonna pick on it. Now normally, or back in 2016, you'd put a picture up and people, like, look at my cool setup, what's your temperatures? They would try and physically dig you to try and find a problem with your setup without that even being part of the situation. It didn't work out, things have changed a little bit now, let's just say that. I put some pictures, and oh wow, that's cool, this and that. I even saw somebody comment, my bearded dragon's been asleep for three hours in the same spot now. Is this normal? What do I do? Is he dead? Do your research before you actually get your bearded dragon. You'll know that they're diurnal and they sleep through the night. Back in the day, that question would have got absolutely slaughtered. Speaking of eggs, we've got more morning gecko eggs. Our morning gecko colony just down here, a big bioactive one just there. You've got a big piece of log work and they've actually set the um, eggs right in between them so you can't really get to them. Next! Look at how fast hornworms grow. We can't get hornworms in the UK. Day one. Day two. Oh god. Day three. I might have to delete that music. I don't want to get copyright clean, but yeah. Hornworms get big, but we can't get them in the UK. I wouldn't mind actually seeing if somebody can ship me some hornworms just to try them. I've got so many animals that would love them. Well, I don't know. I don't know the pros, cons, the benefits. I don't even know if we're even allowed them in the UK. But we can't get them. Next. Cut your bearded dragon's nails and see their reaction. <laughs> He's trying to eat him. Nico! <laughs> He's trying to eat him. He's like, mm, mm, mm. Does your bearded dragon do that? <laughs> Next. Dr. Schrader shows bearded dragon restraint and giving fluids. <laughs> Look at the girl behind the back, she's looking at it going, she knows the camera's there, dead nervously looking. I don't want to be on camera. Head up, they'll just sit quietly for you, so that's one way to do it without doing it with minimal pressure and 
restraint. Um, another element in rehydrating this bearded dragon is going to be some sub Q fluids. So I've got some sub Q fluids here in this, and then we're just going to give this uh, just behind the front leg. Okay, okay, yeah. They're just basically going to show you how to uh, restrain a bearded dragon safely and comfortably so that you can stab it in the side with um, a needle, basically. So next. Just washing my face mask clean. This is not for you. This is not for you. You understand? Yeah. You understand? No! <laughs> I said this wasn't for you! Yeah, you can tell a bearded dragon was dehydrated. He was just wanting the water. He wanted no, to get in there. No, no, Go on, poo in no, it. No, yes! No. Yes! <laughs> my dear, yes! Oh my god. Yes! No. Bearded dragons poo in the worst, worst place possible and it stinks! Yeah. People say my smile is the ugliest and I'll never get any likes. They said nobody will ever want to follow me but only want to stop me. Is this true? Diego, are you ugly? Look at him sat down there. Are you ugly? Have you got an ugly smile? Don't look at me in that tone of voice, woman. Ha! Next! <laughs> Brought a bearded dragon. Oh, please tell me it's not another pool, f pool one. Why would you buy your bearded dragon a floaty when they're quite sharp? Ah, oh, did it rain? Ah, oh. I don't know whether I should agree to giving them enrichment of swimming or not. Let me know in the comments down below. I'm against it personally, but I could be educated into thinking otherwise. Next. For everyone that loved Titan Zoomies. Zoomy Zoomy Titan. Is this the same Titan that had eggs? Psych, she's sneaky. Ha! <laughs> Aww, she's cute. She's cute. Oh, 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 boom! <laughs> so slow, she's almost invisible. Invisible bearded dragons. Gotcha. Oh, 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 hey! Zoomy! Ha! <laughs> Next! Removing my bearded dragon's nose plug. This has become a trend as well, hasn't it? Removing the nose plugs. I think somebody stuck a video and going do 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 poop, and it took like oh, a million ready. views and stuff like that. Now everybody's doing it. If you had your humidity correct, you wouldn't have this problem. Sorry, Just say it. Let's skip it. Next! Everybody who sang to kill him. Oh, I've seen this. Shut up. It's basically a bearded dragon that hatched, deformed, I think, and it's got no arms, no legs, but it's dead alert and active and stuff like that, so I don't know how, he said he's not going to put it down because um, he does, the bearded dragon's showing that he doesn't want to be put down, he's fit and healthy. My question is, he's going to, that bearded dragon's going to need to be physically picked up and moved around to the different locations so he physically can't thermoregulate his own body temperature so he he if he's too hot he can't get himself out of the heat lamp and stuff like that so i don't know i'm following his story i followed him on tiktok so i just want to follow the story and uh, i'll bring you more d news in the future so if you want to see that make sure you hit subscribe if you want next Ooh. Oh, go on, go on. Bearded Dragon's gonna bite the hormone. Please say it's gonna squash. Oh, it squirted all off his face. Oh, look at it all. Oh. Oh. Ugh. Next. What are you? Stop. Stop. Oh. Again, mixing pets and Bearded Dragon. No, but she's gonna do a heart. They're oh. kissing! <laughs> she's a lesbian! <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah. Next. Dude, what is he saying? Uh. Oh no, we've become so smart. They're stupid to us. Huh. Next. Noodles. Your bearded dragon's gonna eat anything that's wriggly that looks like a worm, mate. Stop trying to feed it to him. There's so many stupid things on here. Open the door or I'm gonna throw rocks through your windows, you d I had to stop it there because I knew what kind of word was coming after that one. <laughs> no. Only found out eight years later that my baby has a third eyeball what it.
I'm Googling that. Not now, but I'm Googling it. <laughs> Redneck just yeeted a bearded dragon across the room. Let's watch that again from the start. Let's watch that again. Kid brings it in, drops it on his lap, yeet! Let my lizard free roam! Oh yeah, you've lost him. Whoa! Supersonic bearded dragon. <laughs> got your bug. I've got your bugs. <laughs> yeah, I must admit, those zoomies on the laminate floor, and I do like that. It's good for the nails. It trims them down a little bit. But And plus, it's fun to watch, isn't it? Get them running, get them blood circulating, get the heart rate going. I like that. That's not shocking. That's These good. These yellow things came out of my bearded dragon. Another egg video. <laughs> I had to stop it there because the music behind the back hovered so got copyright claimed for that. <laughs> Next! Bum, 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 bum. Oh no, I'm going to get a copyright claim for this one as well. Stop that just there. It's the bearded dragon shaking his booty. Shaking his booty. Don't judge me. Shower and a bearded dragon. Again, I've had to take the volume off this video. But look at that. Bearded dragon's love and laugh like, yeah. It's like a king. Sat there, loving it. <laughs> that kid, he's got his um, his owners whipped. Let's just say that much. Next, another nose plug one. Right, I'm just going to skip past it. Yes, it's satisfying. No, I don't think you should get a million views and likes and stuff on that video because you should have your humidity a little bit better. Next, another one. Mind you, this ain't too bad actually. This does happen. Me yeah. dragging shedding little pieces and bits and bobs but look at that full beard shed it is satisfying you... Sir, what what are you doing? Hey snake the head of that Did you get it? No. <laughs> I love that one, that was pretty good. Next Beard Dragon's about to jump on a dog. Is he gonna do it? Is he going to do it? Go on. Go on. No, the dog will crap him. Yes, good lad. He just ran on down the side. He knew what was good for him. Good little man. Or as stupid as us. Ah! <coughs> mm, he's just playing. Nothing special. This lizard has been missing in my house for a year. We thought you were dead. <laughs> we gave you a fake ceremony we grieved yeah, we did. I was... how can you lose a lizard for a year i mean granted like baby corn snakes and stuff i can understand that they get in the floorboards and they're they, they've gone well no because they shouldn't escape anyway i've never had one escape don't get me wrong i had charlie there break his enclosure out the back once and he got out the back and he was just found by the rack that that went viral on tiktok that was hilarious but how could you lose a bearded dragon how could you and not find it for a year? Let's face it, I mean, it's not exactly a, a small lizard. He's going to be around somewhere. You'll be able to hear him knocking stuff over. Imagine that, six months later, you're laying in bed, nice and asleep and stuff, and you start hearing rustling and banging and stuff like that. <laughs> no. Next. Oh, oh, where's he gone? Maybe this is how you lose a bearded dragon. He's not in the toilet, mate. What? <laughs> sat out on the porch in the natural sun getting a suntan with a pina colada my type of jig my remote control vacuum made up to be a bearded dragon tank what's life become what am i what am i watching here are some things i wish i knew before i got a bearded dragon go on then crickets smell horrible don't use sand. I used sand and then my first bearded dragon died. Female. I used sand and my first bearded dragon died. Female ones lay eggs. I did not know this. And then there were eggs in Sammy's cake. Don't use those red nighttime lamps because it hits their eyes. They need a very big cage, like a minimum of 50 gallons. 
Yeah. No, a minimum of four foot by two foot by two foot. I don't know why the Americans do it in um, gallons, but the 40 gallon is basically a three foot enclosure. That sort of size, just there, uh, that one. Now, uh, you did dragon facts. You probably didn't know. Shoot, go on. Bearded dragons will often lick their environment. Yes, I did know that. And use Jacobson's organ on the roof of their mouth. So if you didn't know, uh, bearded dragons and most exothermic lizards have got their smell receptor on the inside, on the roof of their mouth. It's called their Jacobson organ. And that's why you often see them going around licking. It's because they're smelling the um, environment that they're in. To identify the microparticles. Yeah, I don't know. Which helps them with understanding their surroundings. This is smell receptor. Such as the temperature, presence of predators. No, temper. I'm just going to skip past that. Oh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Peace out.